Morning, Joseph Duff. I say I'm Rashid from the Indian Institute of Science and Technology. I'm here with the topic of developments in path ignition system to present in this in this evening. Ladies and gentlemen, we are in the age of science and technology. The world is fast towards the rapid growth of technology and decreasing the emission emissions and pollution from the automobile side as we are belong to the mechanical department. So my basic concept is my basic concept involving in this is the improvements and the developments in the spark ignition system, how it has undergone many changes and what are the what were the developments taking place in this system based on the Bajaj, Bajaj company RD development. Let me enter into my presentation. My dear friends, this is the basic model how the spark ignition system works. Initially, how it works. We all have studied in the books that uh, just before the power stroke, a spark will be ignited, and with the spark, the high pressure will be generated in onto the piston, and the force is developed. We, we all know our key acts as just a conductor which which closes the circuit, and when the when the engine starts running, the spark the spark magnets will give just generate the spark, and then uh, the power is produced. This is the distributor. This is the initial initial way how it worked and later on on the research and development of Bajaj company they have developed the system of spark ignitions they were DDSA digital twin spark ignition and digital twin spark spherical conduction system and digital twin spark PL conduction system and DDSA triple spark engine which is now also in the research and development So let, let me elaborate what were these systems are. Digital twin spark ignition. A digital twin spark ignition is, as we studied in the books, in now the bikes running with this technology are not running only with a single single spark plug. It consists of two spark plugs and two cap, two walls, two walls per inlet and two walls for the outlet. As I shown in the which is developed in the software, it consists of two spark plugs and the, uh, the walls are shown inlet and outlet for them. My dear friends, the DTSA technology is running with it. The, uh, in all the bikes as shown in the PPT, and they were Platina XCD 125, 135 disc and 150 cc pulses. The numbers indicate the CC and uh, XCD and Platina and Arthur models. These bikes are running with the DTSA system. Now, and the later on de development of this spark ignition to control the emissions and high, po high power and torque to be developed. They introduced the one more concept from the Bajaj GTF Bajaj company that's called as digital twin spark spherical induction. As we know, the air and the fuel mixture enters into the engine cylinder only by means of walls. In this system, the wall ports are kept in a kept along just aside from the axis, which is called as offset. On this sphere, when when in this system when the fuel enters into the it does not enter only in the conventional manner. It generates a high pressure in the engine cylinder. With this system, the mileage can be increased. And digital twin spark fuel injection. Uh, we know in the petrol engines, we use only the ports to in inject the air fuel ratio by means of a carburetor. But in twin spark fuel injection, the carburetor will be replaced by the Electronic fuel injector, which is controlled by the ECU. ECU is nothing but the engine control unit. It is everything digitalized by means of electronics. A microprocessor will be employed in the system, which can be. This is the electronic control. The ECU is going to control the uh, injector and also spark plugs. The triple, the triple spark mission is the bike running with its LCD and it is the 27% faster than the twin spark and 50% faster than the single spark, single spark. With this system we can produce the high power, high torque and also the emissions are con controlled. Why? Because the complete combustion takes place in the engine, engine cylinder and the carbon dioxide emissions are very decreased. The scope of further development is we can think on the uh, in, uh, implementation of this more spark plug which decreases the uh, emissions and also more power to be developed in the engine cylinder. This, 
This is reference is taken from the Bajaj company uh, research paper. Thank you. Any questions?